guys are more welcome back to my art channel and welcome back to yet another fun episode of Illustrator React. We're gonna react to a drawing duel between Jim Lee, who is actually longer in the comic industry than the comic industry actually exists, probably. And on the other hand, battling him is Kim Sun Gi, the guy who's known for being able to draw everything. I would say he's the best artist in the world right now. So I can't wait to see those guys battling it out on stage of New York Comic Con 2018. So without any further ado, let's jump straight into it. Okay, on the left is Jim Lee and on the right is Kim Sun Gi. We're gonna skip the introduction part because I already introduced them. Okay, let's see what's the first thing they're gonna draw. And to be honest, I am pretty sure that Jim Lee won't stand a chance against Kim Sung Gi. I think Kim Sung Gi is so good. It's it's insane. But let's see. I know you're gonna draw Wonder Woman like looking up with like uh, a couple other spaceships like this. <laughs> He's a master. This guy. He's pretty right. He's known for you drawing the craziest poses from all kinds of different angles and making it look ink so easy. You will see this in a video probably. I think Jim Lee is a bit scared right here, but. Actually, uh, it's understandable. Okay, let's see if they actually are drawing Wonder Woman. Yeah, they are drawing Wonder Woman. And Jim Lee is saying uh, that he is drawing his sorry, fast for, Wonder okay. Woman. We know you and time have a, have a so he's just doing this well, head sketch, which draw, kind of is actually time, epic so because like he's in, uh, such an amazing artist uh, as well. And he has drawn these faces for so me, a million times, times already. So. But can you, you see the difference already? Uh, Jim Lee is doing a really quick Wonder Woman and um, yeah, on the right side you see Kim Jong Gi actually drawing way slower which actually means that he is probably gonna draw something epic crazy. I'm just curious if he will be able to keep up with the speed of Jim Lee because Jim Lee's speed is, is incredible here um, and he has you know an incredible uh, sense of... So this this is just uh, this is the fastest Wonder Woman I do, and it's okay. it's really more like a it's extended the signature. Wonder Woman he does, which looks pretty good, especially considering that he has drawn this Wonder Woman in just a couple of seconds, half a minute maybe. I mean, um, I mean, you can do more to it. I don't know. So this is like a pretty basic. Well, but so, oh, but yeah. okay. Kim Jong Gi, how do you approach your uh, your drawings when you sit down to start drawing? How does the idea of the drawing come to you so fast. Okay, that, now I'm, I'm actually curious how he get the idea what he wants to draw so fast. And he needs um, to translate it because he's Korean and doesn't speak a lot of English, which is unfortunate. But For this yeah. one, he imagined it quickly as soon as he got the Wonder Woman and then try to put down the best composition um, to give you guys have a great time watching. Yeah, we definitely uh, have a great on. time watching. So uh, I think Jim Lee is trying that again because he sees that uh, he will not stand a chance like, uh, if he just do, does this quick sketch. Because you see, <laughs> Kim Jong Gi already like pushing through it's like it's crazy. Just a bit. Man, well, but Jim, I do have to point out that Kim Jong Gi is doing like a full-figured, highly detailed Wonder Woman over there. Yeah, well, I'm gonna, I'm gonna. The the commentator is actually triggering Jim Lee. I look at Kim. He's doing a full figure, and you just did this head sketch. Like, um, oh my God. Pressure on you, but I'm just saying. <laughs> no pressure. No pressure. Look at how crazy it's, and I love how he's using the brush pen. Uh, he's being able to, you know, draw really awesome lines, and then also able to. Render this with the brush pen at work. the same time. <laughs> I don't, I don't know. But I mean, what Jim Lee is drawing here looks pretty, pretty amazing as well. I'm not gonna lie. So really okay, really oh, he's done. Let's so check out easier, his or is it familiarity with character? No, the full artwork. Yeah. So this is whoa, uh, epic. Look, I mean, look at the ball. pose. How much dynamic is that in this pose? And I think it took seven. him like around three to four minutes. It's just insane, I, and I love how, you know, look at how amazing the anatomy is, the foreshortened part, and I love that he just directly also starts, you know, shading in the hair and stuff. That is beautiful. It's so cool. I mean, I love when he's All right, so the art actually is apparently getting pen. several pieces from you guys. Okay. <laughs> you guys are, are, oh my god. Okay, see that guys, he's actually started to push out just another drawing. For me, it's, it's is it still, exactly what, uh, is it Wonder Woman again or what? Looks like? 
Is he drawing a different yeah, character I now? I know this one won't take the full time. He's just like, okay, Jim Lee takes his time on here. Uh, so <laughs> I'm just gonna casually just draw another epic artwork. But I'm not gonna lie, this artwork also looks pretty cool. I'm not sure what he wants to add to this character though. One um, it looks actually really like challenging. she's sitting inside of a car or, or, or uh, on a bike or something. I'm pretty curious what he will end up with. And Kim Jong is already like pushing out the next epic artwork. It's just insane, guys. Okay, yeah, he's adding something like a cockpit now. I mean, those two are just like two of the best artists out there right now. And that would be actually what I would really love to see is one incredible, you know, super famous manga artist in there who would actually be able to compete. For example, um, maybe Horikoshi, someone who's actually able to compete against those guys. That would be epic, to be honest. Okay, we got a... Okay, Jim sketch is finished. And it looks awesome. I mean, I like the, the shape of the fire and that it's just like a cut through shot where you can actually see the whole character and just the, the jet around the character. Pretty epic as well, I have to say. So let's check out the second drawing of Kim Jong gi Oh, pretty epic. Not sure if this is Wonder Woman though. I would give this round to Kim Jong Gi, but I still actually love what uh, Jim Lee did here. And now I already see they are both drawing Batman now. And now I'm pretty curious because Jim Lee is probably best known for his work on Batman. And uh, he has drawn this character for like. I would say a thousand times. On the other hand, Kim Jong-gi can draw actually every character he wants to. I think he really said once in an interview that he is not remembering all the specific details of a character. He is just, he's just really good at remembering the most important things on characters. And then if someone asks him, can you draw Batman? He, or can you draw Iron Man? He can actually uh, remember what are actually the most important parts about Iron Man. Probably the same thing he's being able to do with Batman. So let's see. This one is going to be pretty We wanted pretty to make it epic. challenging for you, Jim. That's right. Because, yeah, Jimmy's Batman looks so good. Look at, I mean, look at this. You can clearly see how many times he has already drawn this character. Uh, so amazing. Pretty epic. Well, you guys both nailed the ears. Ears are tougher than they look. And you can see the difference in style. It's so cool. It's, this is like Kim's and Geese. That's what I was talking about. He's probably more drawing like a, a random dude in a Batman costume and it looks so good. And what I love to see is that look at all those folds and the, the eyes and the, the wrinkles on the mask. Flawless and I mean lifelike. And it's like he's scanning the picture and then. Searching for um, where he has to add the next dot. Jim Lee's version definitely will be super epic. So this is going to be a hard one for Kim Jong Gi. But the amount of detail he adds is crazy. So he's probably already done. Line to accentuate his very strong character. Now he's also adding a background. Okay. Well, why not? If you can draw an amazing character in. Under two minutes, you can also add like a really quick uh, skyline in the back. Yeah. The gauntlet has been thrown. There is Gotham City backgrounds on his back on his uh, Dark Knight drawing, Jim. Just oh, saying. I I hate how the, the commentator actually always is teasing Jim Lee like, ah, oh, look, Kim Jong-un is doing this background as well. And yeah, I I think Jim Lee is reacting to it kind of well. Really friendly, but he was probably really annoyed by this commentator. Um, I would too, as well, because both artists and both artworks are incredible. But yeah, I think there's just no way to compete against Kim Jong Gi, is there? No matter how long you are working in the industry, I have to say I love the shading Jim Lee did here. Uh, looks just like really comic, like super epic. I mean, I think his version looks a lot more epic than. Kim Jong Gi's work of Batman here. I mean, it's it's awesome as well, and he just keeps adding and adding stuff. Um, but it just doesn't look as iconic, I think, as Jim Lee. So I, I think I would I would maybe give it a draw, 
but I like Jim Lee's version just a tiny bit more. Okay, they're... Oh, no, they're doing one more. Another Batman? Right, so okay, one, he is... And then, uh... Doing, like, I, I think Jim Lee's showing a lighting scheme. <laughs> like, Kim jong is, like, going crazy. I mean, that's what I love about him. He's able to draw super realistic characters from all kinds of perspectives. But he also has this amazing sense of humor and doing drawings like this. And I think he's just such a complete artist. He is... For me, probably one of the best, if not, yeah, I'm pretty sure he is the best artist around. Hey, look at him go, technique. we got 28 seconds left. Oh my god. <laughs> I think Jim Lee just wanted to show the audience how you can have different lighting scenes. And Kim Jong-ki just started doodling and is doing this epic artwork, Batman, crossed with an actual bat. Oh my god, it looks so freaking amazing and cool. <laughs> I love it. Yeah, so clear winner of round three, if that actually counts at the round, is Kim Zing Gi. Ten, ten seconds. Good light. Spectacular. So. Ladies and gentlemen, give it up for Kim oh Jong Gi and Jim Lee. I would love to, to actually own this Thank you. bad artwork. Hi, I'm Jackie. Hi. Wow, what an amazing drawing contest. Uh, yeah, I hope you liked it as well. And maybe there are a couple more of these online and if you like this series of drawing duels we will maybe look at some more so let me know down in the comments if you like this video feel free to subscribe that would mean the world to me and that i will hopefully see you guys in my next video so see you bye bye